in this episode, we're going to try out this nilagang ulo ng baboy dito sa kainan nila kay here in Paco, Manila. It's been making such a noise in social media, kaya nandito tayo to try it out. Samahan niyo ako, guys. Let's go. The eatery has a long history. Having been in business since the time when the owner's children were in elementary school. Now, those children have finished college. They began as a humble halo-halo or a popular Filipino dessert vendor and later transitioned into a full-fledged eatery. The eatery is famous for its nilagang ulo ng baboy, which is a Filipino dish featuring boiled pig's head. This dish costs 200 pesos per order, and although it is considered relatively expensive for a carinderia, it already includes half the head of the pig and can serve two to three people. Their nilagang ulo ng baboy has a very tender meat, which easily separates from the bone. No effort needed when scrapping the meat off. Kaina nilakay typically sells around 50 pieces of pork head daily, resulting in 100 to 140 orders on average. Another popular dish they offer is gigantic sinigang na panga ng isda for 140 pesos. Sinigang is a Filipino sour soup and panga ng isda refers to the fish head. They prepare these dishes in an old school way, using wood as the heat source. So we are here in Kainan de Lakay and as you can see we have here Lasabao. We are here for Lasabao. So may order tayong panga. It's a fish here. The sinigang. Ulo ng maya maya. Sarap. Pang masa sa. Yung lasa. Pang masa. Yan, maya maya. The eatery also serves other Filipino dishes such as lechon kawale, yempo, sisig, dinuguan, beef steak, and a lot more. The dining space at Kainan Nilakay can accommodate approximately 30 people and features tables and chairs under a shed, creating an alfresco setting. Beef steak, malambot na malambot, kung kayuto. Sarap ng putahe nila. Dinarayo talaga to dito. People drive from all the way from far places para kumain dito. Iba't ibang putahe, lutong bahay talaga. Saka, hindi lang tayo nag-order, pero mukhang masasarap talaga. Lahat sila masarap. Mm. The eatery tends to get crowded with customers starting to arrive around 8 a.m. It's advisable to visit early to secure a table. Their nilagang ulo ng baboy and sinigang na panga usually last until lunchtime only. Kaina nilagay is open daily from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m., providing a wide window for customers to enjoy their delicious Filipino dishes. And there you have it. If you're looking for more affordable but delicious food spots around the metro, you should check out the Sinigang Nikagawat in Manila for a savory authentic Sinigang or Pat Pat's Kansi in Makati for their delicious take on Sinigang and Bulalu Fusion as well as Bulaluhan sa Laon Laan in Manila for their delectable beef shang and pollutant dishes. If you have any suggestions and inquiries, just reach out by commenting down below. Don't forget to click the subscribe and notification bell for more updates. Thank you for watching and I'll see you at the next one. Bye!